Hello and welcome back to Script Case by Jamie. That is me, by the way. If you didn't already know that, thank you for watching, thank you for joining, and of course, I hope you are enjoying the content. And in this series of videos, I am showing you just how awesome Script Case really is. Because just with a few clicks, within a few seconds, you can create very simple and super advanced, fully functional applications. And so far, I believe we have nearly gone through all of them. We are now left with the control application. So I'll choose the control and click create. Now, the control application has two options. So I will go ahead and choose new application again, and at the same time, choose control again, and this time set the template HTML manually and generate one of those also, because they those are two different types of control forms. Yes, we had different views with the forms, and I did not show those because those are completely different. In this case, the control form, you create the form. Right now, neither of these applications have any fields or data or anything associated to them. It is just the framework. So from here, I can go ahead and choose to add as many fields as I want, assign names to those, whatever I want that to be, and I can then also choose the type that I want those fields to, well, to be. What type of fields? what I want them to act like, how I want them to look, <laughs> what type of fields are they? You know, all of that is there within the data type. You have so many options here, but for the real full list, check out the form application because there you have more options. Now, the same fields you have available within the other control form, but the difference is you do not have this interface. You will have to create that interface yourself in code and you have here a fully functional editor slash designer for that. You can also use external libraries if you have attached one, which in this case I have not yet. And there you have from script case various form types and templates that you can actually use and check out how to use the control form. Again, this one is fully customized. It is not a click, click, click. It is really a code, code, code. Okay, and now that you know, thank you for watching and until the next video.